Hey guys, welcome to Computer Made Simple. Today I will show you another setup video of a brand new laptop computer to show you how easy it is to do and how simple and fast it can be done. Basically this whole setup took me about 15 minutes. As you can see everything is brand new, just out of the box. And uh, yeah, so this whole setup is fairly easy. Anyone can do it. The whole uh, user inputs takes you about maybe three minutes total. The rest is just waiting for the computer to set up. And I'm just gonna show you how easy and simple it is to do. So now I'm just unpacking this laptop. This is a Toshiba Cosmio X870, if I'm not mistaken. It's a 17 inch powerhouse laptop. It's called a desktop replacement. This thing is massive and very powerful. Um, uh, if you remember my previous video, I was setting up a Lenovo ThinkPad and you'll see that this set of video is a little different because Toshiba includes different software and bundles different options and the whole setup procedure computer wise, I should say the automated part is going to be different. But the setup that we have to do, the inputs are exactly, exactly the same. So now I'm just plugging in the power and we're going to turn on the computer. And you'll see some of the parts where the computer is thinking and being set up. I will have fast forward to save you some time. But this video is not cut. So it's just one take and you can see how easy it is to do. Some stores will try to charge you a setup fee of $100 or maybe a little less, maybe a little more. It's just very simple answer. You don't need to pay that much money. You can do it yourself. Manufacturers do this on purpose. They make it as streamlined and as easy as possible as a setup. And I'll show you for a second time how easy and simple it is to do. So now the computer's just thinking. Basically, there's an image that's been installed by factory. Um, sorry, from the factory by default. And we'll go through the steps. So here it's asking us, uh, do we want English or French? And it'll tell you that once you choose an option, you cannot undo it. So I think it's fairly obvious if you want it to be in English or French. Then we'll choose country, region, time settings, and the keyboard layout. By default, these settings are perfect for me. So Canada, Eastern, and US type keyboard. Now it's asking for a computer name and a username. Uh, you can put whatever you want at this step as these names can be changed later on once we're inside the operating system. Okay, so I've decided to use Bob for the purpose of this video. I'm going to click next. And now it's asking for a password. I highly recommend that you guys set up a password. In this video, I don't. You do not need to set one. But as I've presented in another video that I'll put a description in a link soon, you can find a link right here. Actually, I lied. Right here, right now. Yes. So if you go watch this video, you'll see why you want to put a password for the admin account because basically an admin account can do anything. Now it's asking you for some agreements. You can read through it, but if you don't accept them, you can't install the software. So we'll just accept the default. Uh, now it's asking what kind of protection for Windows do we want to download settings automatically? We'll use the recommend, recommended settings. Time zone, uh, Eastern time minus five is perfect for us. And now it's asking if you want to log into a wireless network. You could just select your network, put in your passkey to connect your network and it would do so right away. Or you can decide to skip this step if you do not want to do this at this time. Once again, this can be done from the desktop once we're inside the operating system later on. And that was pretty much all the input required of us. As you can see now, the computer will set up some softwares. I will speed it up right now. Um, some of the things are Windows based, as you can see preparing your desktop, so it's just preparing it for first use. And then the Toshiba program will kick in and install all what I call the bloatware. Here we have Norton asking us if we want to use their trial 30 day free subscription. Um, it's up to you. I love how they say stay unprotected. It's a little unfair to put such aggressive marketing but we can find a free antivirus that is just as good uh, from Microsoft. That sadly is not installed by default on the operating system, 
but it's free to get. As you can see, Toshiba is doing their, their own thing, installing, configuring the system. The computer will reboot a couple times, and after about 15 minutes total, our desktop is gonna be ready to go. And here we are. Everything's ready for first use. Go to computer settings and properties. We can see that everything's ready to go. Everything is recognized. You can see the computer name, our username Bob, and everything is ready to go. So that took me about 15 minutes. Actual user input, maybe four minutes. This is very easy to do, very simple and quick. And I hope you guys feel confident now to do it on your own. Please don't let the big stores charge you $100 for the simple steps and encourage others to do it also. It's always a good way to learn about the computer and have some input into it. And you feel a bit more proud when you do it yourself. Thanks for watching, guys. Once again, have a great day and I'll see you next time.